My name is John McBroom and I'm the Commercial Director at Total Performance Data. So can you tell us a little bit about Total Performance Data? Total Performance Data uses the latest GPS tracking technology to create positional data during horse races. We track every horse during a race and that gives us the ability to create second by second sectional timing, live speed data, information about how far the horses have run and, and how the horses run, whether they stride particularly slowly or quickly, whether they stride particularly long or short. Um, the GPS data also uh, powers graphics for broadcast, both at the racetrack and on TV and streaming. We recently overlaid our data onto uh, jockey cam footage so that at the Breeders' Cup, so viewers could see the race from the jockey's perspective, but also have live information about how quickly the horse is running, what position it was in, how far it was from the finish. Um, so our, our technology is at racetracks in the UK, the US, Canada and South America and we're installing it new tracks uh, in those territories and uh, around the world. And what are your plans for in-play betting? So that data from the GPS system, uh, the positions, um, the speed data, the pace of the race, the stride data has enabled us to create an in-play betting product for horse racing, um, for racing in the UK, in France and uh, in North America. Uh, that in-play product is now in the roadmap for Tier 1 operators in the UK and um, will enable betting from the start of the race right up until one furlong from the finish. Previous iterations of in-play betting for horse racing have focused on manual solutions to capture late money. TPD's in-play betting automates that bet acceptance uh, aspect but also uh, enables betting throughout the majority of the race. How important is data in influencing the customer experience for horse racing bettors? Yeah, I think it's, it's hugely important. When we talk about in play, we're also talking about improving the live experience for horse racing bettors. Um, and we're going to be doing that by overlaying our data onto streaming and uh, enhanced visualisation to give uh, people watching racing a better idea of what's going on during the race and what might happen during the race. So things like um, energy usage for each horse, uh, jumping efficiency metrics, whether the horses are going faster or slower than expected, all this information to help the, the viewer understand more and uh, have a feeling about how the race is going to work out. Um, how important is innovation for horse racing? Yeah, I think it's really important. I think um, horse racing is competing with, with other sports, both uh, inside and outside the, the betting world. Um, there's a sort of regular debate about how racing can increase revenue uh, and that debate, in, including at this conference, often revolves around the fixture list, whether to expand it, whether to decrease the number of fixtures, change race times or meeting schedules. Uh, we think it's vital that racing um, extracts the maximum value from the existing product. Um, Racing is competing for, for roadmap space with betting operators against uh, soccer, tennis, esports, American football. Um, and operators are always going to prioritize their roadmap on sports that they think are going to provide growth opportunities and return on investment. Um, and unless racing innovates, it's going to lose that uh, competition with those other sports. So can you tell us a little bit about cash out for horse racing? Yeah, so our in-play uh, betting products um, will also have the ability to power cash out from pre-race to live. So customers that have put a bet on before the race and see their horses going well will have the ability to cash that bet out. Uh, it's also going to drive um, stake insurance where a customer could have the option of being refunded their original stake if the horse hits a certain price um, during the race.